I do apologize for the visible quality of this video. I'm not sure why, but I'm going to make it short. I've been doing a survey of communities in my region and making a comparison about what tribulation will look like. And I can just tell you right now what is rotting from the inside out is exactly the one very key ingredient is the drugs from the border into our neighborhoods and this is coming from a constable in our area that there's no chance for our children in these communities to escape it so what is tribulation going to look like it is going to be the drugs in the community in our area. If there's one thing that is going to impact our neighborhoods the most, it is going to be the drug and access to drugs and overdoses that are raging in our communities. So one of the things that are often left out of the conversation when we talk about pre-tribulation rapture discussion topics is the raging drug problem that is infesting and gutting out our communities. I wanted to say this as a topic, but because of the fuzzy quality of the video, I'm not gonna get into this topic as deeply as I'd like to. I did wanna say this, that we are looking at the factors that are gonna play into the tribulation. What is going to lead people down the wrong road? Well, that's one of them. Now, we could go into a list of them, like I said, but this is just one topic that I think here locally that is infested. And we're talking about a bed bug infestation, roach infestation that is epic in this community alone. Now, I'm saying it because I see it firsthand experiences. I've known this area to be pretty dilapidated, to be quite honest. So why I wanted to discuss it is because this is what's happening. Pestilence, as it states in the Bible, that there would be pestilence and there would be all these unnatural events that would take place before the return of the Lord. We're seeing it happen. Have you witnessed it yourself? Rodents in infestation. You heard about it in New York, about the thousands of rats that were infestation and a story about a year ago. You heard about these stories that there's like an infestation of uh, locusts in parts of the world. I think it was in Nigeria or Africa somewhere. Well, one of those places, nonetheless, it's just a reality of one of the stories of pestilence. Of A good title for this video is Pestilence and Drugs and what it's going to do to rot this world. You know, Jesus often said, he said, your works are but filthy rags. I often wonder what he meant by that when he said that our works are like filthy rags. So does that mean we don't clean up ourselves and clean up our lives? No, that, that, that's not what he meant by that. But he said that our works to get to heaven are but filthy rats because it's not what we do that is going to get us to heaven. It's by faith in him and his death and resurrection at the cross by repentance of sins that gets us to Jesus Christ. So with that, I want to take the time to mention that. Sorry about the quality of the video. I really wish I could have done better with it. I guess it's one of those things. It's like, you know, the phones, they're only made to last for so long. And then it's time to buy another one. And I don't know, maybe I'm in the 
situation where I have to buy a new phone. <laughs> I get. Okay, thank you for watching and God bless you and hallelujah that I got to get this message out to you. I pray for Lord. God bless you.